Channel 3 Early Warning Weather. Well, if you're looking for some rainy days to kick back and enjoy some time inside, we've got plenty of those in the forecast. We'll start with tomorrow. Wind gusts through the day will pick up a little bit, expecting a bit of a breeze coming out of the southeast, south, uh, south and southwest. Expecting gusts mostly between about 15 to 20 or so miles an hour. So certainly not talking a damaging wind here by any means, but the breeze will pick up through the morning and into the early afternoon. Notice that there's a bit of a lag time for the breeze inland. That's because we need to wait for the warmer air to surge in before we actually will see the breeze pick up. For tonight, we expect low temperatures to happen by midnight. Shortly thereafter, we may see temps actually climb heading into the morning. That's all thanks to wind shifting to be out of the south as well as increasing clouds. By uh, the start of the day tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies expected, and eventually that will give way to some rain. Showers turn to steadier and heavier rain. Futurecast does show some cloud cover already by 7 o'clock this evening. But notice that first batch of clouds moves from west to east. Later tonight, we start to see wind uh, shift to be out of the south, and we will also pull in our clouds from the south. This is a big change in air mass for us. A couple of stray showers possible before sunrise tomorrow. Shortly thereafter, we will start to see thicker clouds build in, and it's all thanks to this front right here. Weak area of low pressure along the front, high pressure off to our north and to our east. That reinforces uh, some of that southerly wind. This helps to bring some rain to Connecticut. By the time we get to the uh, middle of the morning tomorrow, we will start to see more showers give way to steadier rain. By the time we get into the evening, we see our first batch of steady rain roll through. Periods of rain expected with this front nearby. By early Wednesday morning, there may be a brief break, but it's only temporary. We start to see more showers build in throughout the day. Wednesday, again, periods of rain expected, especially some of this right here that's just off the coast of New Jersey and south of Long Island. All this needs to do is shift about 50 miles north, and we still have steady rain ongoing through the evening on Wednesday before things finally trend drier into Thursday morning. So fairly unsettled over the next couple of days. However, with periods of rain and it being the cold season, so our rain processes themselves aren't quite as efficient, we're still expecting about a half inch to an inch total, maybe some locally higher amounts mixed in. Of course, tonight was a wonderful sunset. Here's a live look in our iCam in Torrington. If you got any sunset pictures, send them in to us. We'd love to see them. Look at this in Old Saybrook right now. Skies are bright and orange, a little bit of pink starting to appear. And here's a live look from the capital city of Hartford. And remember, you can get hour by hour forecasts right in the palm of your hand. The WFSB weather app, it's free. Tomorrow, you can use the radar on it to track those showers from the comfort of your couch, too. 38 right now in Kent, 44 in Norwich, uh, 43 in Willington. Uh, 42 in Woodbridge. Notice in Norwich and Willington, eastern side of the state, where we've seen some of that southerly wind dew points are back up too. Compared to yesterday at this time, we are about 5 to almost 10 degrees milder, and we expect temperatures to actually trend upward by the time we get to sunrise tomorrow. So, daybreak tomorrow, we start to watch temps increase. We end up back in the mid to upper 50s uh, statewide tomorrow, rather low to mid 50s. By Wednesday, though, we're tracking temperatures to return to the mid to upper 50s. That's about 10 degrees above average for this time of year. Certainly a bit breezier on Wednesday, though, and we are expecting things to be rather wet throughout the day. Thursday trends a bit drier and we stay mild. Temperatures in the 50s again on Thursday. Breezy and cooler by Friday back down into the 40s. Saturday, maybe a shower to start the day off. A rain shower, that is, with temperatures trending downward into the start of next week. Breezy conditions sticking around and the active pattern is expected to continue.